Hi, welcome to the Swamp Rabbit Inn. I'm Wendy Lynham, I'm the owner, and we're all about the bike here. In fact, our tagline is bike in, bike out. So come on in and I'll show you around. As I mentioned, we're all about the bike. Bike in, bike out at the Swamp Rabbit Inn. We're two blocks from the Swamp Rabbit Trail and two blocks from downtown Greenville. We also have a brand new inn in Traveler's Rest right on the Swamp Rabbit Trail, 10 miles up the trail from here. Whether you're on one of our rental bikes or a road bike or mountain bike, the Swamp Rabbit Inn and Properties is always a great home base for your cycling adventures. Swamp Rabbit Trail is two blocks out our front door and we're going to take you on the Swamp Rabbit Trail and show you some of our favorite stops. Come on. So this is the Swamp Rabbit Cafe and Grocery. This is two miles up the Swamp Rabbit Trail from our inn in downtown Greenville. And it's about eight miles from our inn in Traveler's Rest. So come on inside, we'll show you around. We're at the Swamp Rabbit Inn in downtown Traveler's Rest, right across the street from the Swamp Rabbit Trail. We love this location because it's at the base of some of the best road riding and very near a lot of good mountain bike trails as well. So if you're coming to Greenville to ride, you definitely want to consider the Swamp Rabbit Inn and Traveler's Rest. It will put you right where you want to be to enjoy the most that upstate South Carolina cycling has to offer. Now I'm in the kitchen of the Swamp Rabbit Inn and Traveler's Rest. This is our newest property and this inn is also right on the Swamp Rabbit Trail. Both of our inns are 10 miles apart and come and explore downtown Traveler's Rest with us. There's a lot of fun things to do here as well. So this is one of the closest restaurants to the Swamp Rabbit Inn and TR. It's about three blocks from the inn. You can walk here. This is Farmhouse Tacos and TR Tasting Room, and we're gonna take you inside and just show you what they look like. If you want good coffee and crepes, this is a great place to end a ride, begin your day cycling. This is Tandem Crepery, and it's about six blocks from the Swamp Rabbit Inn and Traveler's Rest, right off the Swamp Rabbit Trail. This is probably our favorite watering hole on the Swamp Rabbit Trail. This is the Swamp Rabbit Brewery. Oh, yeah. And they have great beers. Red Whitey is my personal favorite, but these beers will do you right. So you gotta check out the Swamp Rabbit Brewery. the cafe at Williams Hardware. This was actually the first business on the Swamp Rabbit Trail. It's owned by two sisters who grew up in Traveler's Rest and these ladies had vision. They're very bike friendly. They have restrooms down below here and water to fill up your water bottles. And then if you go upstairs, there's a great gift shop with a lot of local items and wonderful home cooked food at the cafe at Williams Hardware. Sidewall Pizza 
pizza. This is one of our favorite lunch and dinner spots. Pizza is excellent, but there's also a great selection of beer, really awesome salads, and homemade ice cream. One thing cool about all these businesses that we've shown you today is that they're all locally owned. The owners of the businesses are here. You see them taking care of their landscaping. They greet you at the front door. And it's just such a good sense of community around this bike trail, the Swamp Rabbit Trail.